Greetings, everyone. Welcome to the Pfizer Big Picture Challenge. I'm your host, Shannon Oliver. The Big Picture Challenge is brought to you by Viagra from Inwood ED and New Tobias for OAB. Let's go over how the Big Picture Challenge is going to be played. This is the puzzle board. As you can see, we have 12 tiles that are concealing a secret message. As we play the game, I'll be removing tiles, and at the end of our game, whoever has the highest score gets the first shot at solving our secret message. All of the multiple choice questions will appear on this screen here, and be sure you're quick on the trigger because we're not only keeping track of how many correct answers you get, but also how quickly you enter that correct answer. And just so you know, all of our puzzles are done in a rebus concept. Are any of you familiar with what a rebus is? It's a kind of word puzzle where we use pictures to represent a word or parts of a word. Let's start with this one. So if I showed you this, you would say, <laughs> right, here, H and ear, run them together and you get here. All right, this one's a little trickier. Right, birthday, B and earth and D and hay. So you get birthday. All right, now that everyone understands how we're going to play, let's go ahead and get started. We'll play in two rounds. The first round will be all about Viagra. The second round will be all about Tobias. And as I said, I'll be removing tiles throughout the game, but if you could hold off on guessing the secret message until the end, we're gonna let the high score get the first shot at solving that. All right, let's bring up the first question. Viagra can offer a more satisfying sexual experience for men with erectile dysfunction. In 26 flexible dose studies, men taking Viagra for ED reported what percentage of improvement over baseline in the frequency of satisfying sexual interaction? Is it 94%, 67%, 80%, or 55%? Buzz in your answers. All right, let's take a look and see what you thought. Well, it looks like it was a close tie between answer one and answer two, 94% and 67%. Let's see who was correct. Number one was the correct answer. Men with ED reported a 94% improvement over baseline in the frequency of satisfying intercourse versus 22% with the placebo. Let's bring up the next question. 